guys welcome back to another episode of moments with nikki hope you enjoyed my previous episode and if this is your first time coming to my youtube channel please 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 subscribe and don't forget to click on the notification bell so you get notified when i post my next video yes welcome back guys so today we're talking about something completely different completely different i am super excited about this video because i'll be talking about something a lot of people don't know about like you don't have any idea a lot of people don't know about because they don't really do research online to know more about Some themselves in certain kind of way they don't know why they behave this today i'll be way. talking about astrological signs which is also known as the zodiac sign Just today i'll be telling you 12 signs of a zodiac sign the meaning how they behave everything you need to know about the zodiac sign yeah let's go oh. so no. let's start with the first zodiac sign which is hmm. the aquarius mm, 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 mm. aquarius people which is also known as the air sign they are those that are born between january 20th and um, february 18th one thing you should know about the Aquarius is they are very shy and quiet. I used to have a friend which is Aquarius, so I can I can attain to that. I can confirm that they are very shy, they are quiet, they are energetic, and they are very intelligent. That's one thing. One thing that amazes me about Aquarius people is how quick they like solving problems. Like they they are always the first person to bring a solution to to the problem. So they think very fast. That's the beautiful thing about. about Aquarius and one thing you should also know about the zodiac sign called Aquarius is They love being with a group of people like they like being around people Aquarius They like being around people and they are not the best when it comes to expressing their emotion They don't know how to express their emotion. Maybe it's just too much for them But they really don't know how to express their emotion Aquarius So if you are an Aquarius person and you have this car sign, you just know that it's not your fault It's just a zodiac the sign. The second zodiac sign is Pisces, which is the water sign. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, <laughs> the Pisces sign. Um, are, they are those that are born between February 18th and March 20th. Yeah, extremely friendly. Like the Pisces are extremely friendly. They are compassionate. They are selfless. They are actually, they are actually good in making friendship. Like they know how to maintain friendship. That is just something about Pisces. And are very very talented, especially when it comes to music not all of not all of them i know i think i know a pisces person not all of them but when it comes to anything relating to heart they are smart so yeah they tolerate a lot yes they have a high level of tolerance yes they tolerate a lot and one thing they don't like pisces one thing they really really hate so much is they hate being criticized you want to get on a pisces nerve you want to get get a pisces angry criticize them then you will see their angry mood <laughs> like they get so angry when you criticize so them. the top sign is iris sign iris sign is the fire sign if you are born between march 21st and april 19th you are an iris and one thing you should know about iris people one thing i love about iris people is how energetic they are how dynamic they are and how competitive they have they have this competitive spirit like they want to compete they have this so yeah i like i like that i like that about aries yeah <laughs> one thing you should know about aries is that they are very very highly organized and they excel in multitasking like they can multitask i don't know how they do it though like multitasking to them is it comes effortlessly like they don't just stress themselves so yeah aries kudos to you guys you guys you guys are good in that and um, they have a strong personality that can be impatient and moody yeah they have this weird character they can be moody and sometimes the but this sign is taros gang 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 the taros sign is the earth sign it comes with people that are born between april april 20th and um, may 20th so if you are born between those dates you are a taros i have a friend which is a taros and the guy is cute he is a very he has a very amazing i would describe him as an amazing person because he has a very very unique and amazing character so let's get into this taros people one thing you should know about taros is they are very sensible and they are very reliable and they are so caring oh my god yes i can confirm that 100 percent taros are very caring like they do it effortlessly i feel it comes with them like that to me that is the sweetest part about them and also they can be so overprotective which 
can scare people away. Taros people can be so overprotective. But when it comes to people that they love and when it comes to their friends, they are loyal to the fault. Like they are loyal friends. So um yeah, that's something you know about Taros. And Taros people they don't really like sudden change and they don't like feeling insecure. When you start making a Taros person feel insecure, you are pushing them away. So yeah, that's what you should know about Taros. Fifth sign is the Gemini sign. Ah, I'm gonna drink to that. <laughs> I love the smoothie, guys. It's so nice. So, as you all know, I'm a Gemini. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am. <laughs> I'm a Gemini, and I am so proud of being a Gemini. So, the Gemini is an air zodiac sign, which uh, people that are born between May 21st and June 20th. Yes. Uh, a lot of people say Gemini's are two-faced but it depends can easily switch to be who we want to be and also is on we are the life of the party we if are excellent writers we are we, we are a good communicator we're very outspoken mm -mm. Gemini they are, we are so outspoken like when it comes to me if I'm angry at something I express my emotion that moment like I express my feeling that moment and when I do that I feel relief that is just me so yeah, if you have this kind of character in you, just know that you are a Gemini and it's just who you are. You are just a beautiful, beautiful Gemini prince or princess, yeah. <laughs> and now uh, what Gemini's hate is, uh, we hate feeling confined or restricted. Like, you don't want to confine the Gemini and you don't want to restrict a Gemini. We are like a bird, we like to fly, we like to explore, we just want to be free. So Gemini's can be so indecisive and inconsistent dun, 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 dun. yes i am the most indecisive person on the planet earth yes i agree to that i can be so indecisive when it comes to making some certain kind of decision which i am working on but for now i can say i'm so indecisive but it's not a problem it's just my zodiac sign it's just who i am but yeah hopefully i'll get better on that <laughs> Okay, now let's go to the sixth sign, which is the cancer sign. I have a friend which is a cancer, so let's see how she behaves. Yeah, the cancer sign is the water sign, which are people that are born between June 21st and July 22nd. Yes, what do you know about cancer sign is they are very emotional. They, are, they might come out tough, strong. Oh God, I'm not going to crack. I'm this, I'm that. But they are super emotional. They are sensitive. They are sentimental. And... One thing you should know is, is, is the that hat that rules the other sign, like they are like the queen of the other signs. They rule the other sign. The cancer sign is a very powerful sign. So if you are a cancer, you are a very you have this their personality is so powerful. And um, they are very loyal and they are very empathetic. They make good friends. Like if I have a friend which is a cancer, and so their sign is cancer, she's a she's she's my go-to person i i love her she's amazing she gives good advice yes and once you get to know a cancer you will want to leave them we all need a cancer person in our life because they make amazing good friends they also avoid conflict and comfort, confrontation they don't like quarrel because they are just this peaceful human being that like doing their thing like getting things done and they are loyal they're just amazing cancer they're so amazing and the seventh sign is the Leo. The Leo sign is fire zodiac sign. And those that are born between July 23rd and August. One thing you should know about Leo is they are very self-confident. Oh God, I give it to them 100%. They are so self-confident. They motivate a lot. Being around the Leo person, you get motivated to do what you want to do. They motivate and they are very goal-oriented. Like if they want to do something, they get it done that moment. And they make excellent leaders. Yeah, they actually do. They know how to lead. They know how to carry the crowd. To them, it comes naturally. To them, they do it effortlessly. One thing I really love about Leo is the wonderful sense of humor that they have. Like their sense of humor is so high. They have a very beautiful sense of humor, and they are very, and they are very resourceful. They know how to create solutions to problems very fast very very fast when it comes to Leo they are proud of their achievements and sometimes that thing gets into their head and they can be so proud sometimes and be rude though that's one thing I don't like about them like they are proud of what they can do and it gets into their head and they start acting up so yeah that's that's not so good about Leo but 
without that they are an amazing people amazing personality view yeah so the eighth sign is virgo oh my kid brother is a virgo okay yeah and the kid brother is a virgo he was born september 9 so um virgo are people virgo is the eighth sign it symbolizes the egg sign and there are people that are born between august 23rd and september 22nd so if you are born between those uh, those uh dates you are a virgo Vir <laughs> One thing you should know about Virgo is they crave for attention. Mm. Attention, they are on, they need, they love attention. So you have a Virgo in your life, give them the attention that they need because they really love that. And they are very, they have OCD, like they are neat freak. They need a little dirt can turn them off. So they like things to be well organized. I call them neat freak, yeah. Virgo and also they hate to ask for help. They feel they can do everything themselves, which actually they can because they have the strong personality. It, it's just beautiful. Like I really admire that about Virgo and they work hard to achieve their goals. They are not lazy. Virgo are people that if they want to get things done, they get it done with hard work. They do it and they love animals. Oh my God, this is so true. My younger brother loved dogs so much. I remember back home, like it's always with our dogs and everything. So yeah, that is so true about Virgo. They are animal lovers. So the ninth sign is Libra. Hmm. Libra symbolize the air sign and these are people that are born between September 23rd and October 22nd Libra people they are amazing set of people they are, they have this beautiful they have this unique let me describe it as unique <laughs> they have unique characters um they can be so diplomatic sometimes they are very diplomatic you just can't tell them what to do because they have their second way of doing their things and one thing you should know about Libra is in order to avoid an unbalanced environment they will avoid conflict at all costs like they just want everything around them to go as planned so if anything is going to come and disturb them they just shift away from it so yeah that's something about Libra they are very intelligent they are they're so intellectual like and they are good looking Libras are they good know looking how to like, create good conversation like if you have a problem or you're bored or you look, need solution to something talk to a libra person like they know how to create good good conversation and they love to surround themselves with beautiful things libra they love expensive things you want to get a libra a gift to get that libra an expensive gift they love expensive things that is just how they are and the tenth zodiac sign is scorpio the scorpio is a water sign and this these are people that are born between october 23rd and november 21st Scorpio. My best friend is a Scorpio. She was Scorpio people are very passionate with a fiery spirit. Like their spirit is so they have this fiery spirit in them, yeah. And they wear their hats on the sleeve. Like they don't care. They do whatever they wanna do. Yeah, that's how they are. I know how to keep secrets, which I can attain. I can confirm that, yeah. They're very good at keeping secrets. Scorpio people, yes. And uh, they hold on to friendship for a very long time. They know how to keep friendships, Scorpio, and also they hate dishonesty. That thing turns them off. Don't be honest to them; it's gonna push them off. They hate dishonesty. Yeah, that's something you should know about. And the Scorpio. level sign is Sagittarius. Sagittarius symbolizes the fire sign, and these are people that are born between November 22nd and December 21st. The Sagittarius are people that are extremely curious like the curiosity curious thing in them comes naturally they are so curious they want to know everything they are, they just want to know how things are done in every way curiosity to them is normal because it just comes with them and they love to travel yes sagittarius people they travel a lot they just travel and they hate to feel feel um, constrained you you can't constrain a, a sagittarius person you just need to let them do whatever they want to do have this extrovert personality yeah they are everywhere Sagittarius people oh god oh god they are everywhere I know I have a friend who, which is a Sagittarius this is so true they are they are so extrovert yeah they have the ability to make their dream come true which is their, their go-getter they get things done they are very focused in their dream like if they want to do something no one can distract them they're like okay I want to get this done I'm going to get this done so yeah that's something about Sagittarius which which I love and respect about them they have amazing personality the so, sign is the Capricorn mm. the Capricorn symbolize the earth sign which are people that are born between 
December 22nd and January 19th. And these people, they are so disciplined. Oh God, they are so street. I feel they should even be lecturers. Most of them are lecturers. Most Capricorn I know, they are lecturers or they are doing one serious job because they are very, very disciplined. Like, and they have excellent self-control in making good leader. They are always good leaders. They have this, they have this leadership character in them. It comes effortlessly to them. Yeah, that is how they are. And Capricorn to Capricorn, Cap family comes first. Like they take family so serious, which is so beautiful, very, very beautiful. I admire, admire that about them. Now, another thing you should know about Capricorn is they can be so stubborn. Capricorn are stubborn. So, e God, you, you, you might think a Gemini is stubborn or a Cancer is stubborn. You've not met a Capricorn. When you meet a Capricorn, you know that, oh my God. Mm -mm 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 -mm. No, this is the worst. <laughs> yeah, so responsible and they have this serious personality in them. They're too serious. You can't, you can't, there are some jokes you can't even see around a Capricorn person because they are going to take it like, oh, don't insult me, don't insult me, don't. <laughs> so yeah, they can be so serious sometimes, but it's beautiful. So now I've explained the 12 zodiac sign to you. So if you have this character in you and you've been wondering, why am I acting this way? Why am I behaving this way? Now you know why you are behaving this way. Now you know why you are acting this certain type so of way. So thank you so much Not for taking your time to watch this video. Please, please, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And if this is your first time, please subscribe. Don't forget to click on the notification bell so you get notified when next I post my next video. I still remain your girl, Nikki, and I'll see you some other time. Bye.